What does it mean to be American? Being American is about freedom. No, it's about hot dogs, dog. Actually, it's about the opportunity to follow your dreams. Although those are all somewhat true, to be American means to celebrate diversity and contribute one's own unique perspective. To understand American diversity, we first have to examine the history of American diversity. In 1790, the U.S. Census shocked the world by showing America's incredibly diverse with Dutch, French, German, Swedish, Scottish, Irish, English, and African American people. A century later, Ellis Island served as a way of passage for millions of immigrants from 1892 to 1954. It contributed to the immigration population so immensely that it is estimated that 40% of all U.S. citizens can trace back at least one ancestor to Ellis Island. One of the reasons why America is such a diverse and inclusive nation is because we're a nation of immigrants. Our founders conceived of this country as a refuge for the world. And for more than two centuries, welcoming wave after wave of immigrants has kept us youthful and dynamic and entrepreneurial. It has shaped our character and it has made us stronger. Today, globalization, the process of global interactions between people, organizations, and businesses has exposed America to all different types of people, contributing to our economic and social life. Today, diversity plays a major role in the lives of many Americans. Diversity has a positive social impact. Learning about other cultures is enriching. Diversity also has a large influence in American pop culture, food, music, movies, and art. Even though we're different, these differences bring us closer together. I firmly believe that the United States of America is the greatest nation in the world because of our ability to embrace men and women of diverse backgrounds and provide them with opportunities to succeed. Colleges and universities that welcome diversity provide their students with opportunity many in the world can never hope to obtain. Learning with people from different backgrounds spurs creativity and innovation. Research has shown that increased, excuse me, <clears throat> increased racial diversity on campuses produces higher, higher levels of academic achievement for all students. And Fortune 500 companies agree that embracing diversity is good for the bottom line. In America, we celebrate diversity because it makes our country unique and special. No other country embraces diversity in the same way. America recognizes that our differences bring a learning opportunity for all. The city of Houston is a great example of American diversity at its best. Houston definitely is one of the most diverse cities in the United States and possibly the world. Uh, I think you have a lot of cultural exchange there where we're getting really the best of the world. You learn a lot from each other when you talk to each other. I think that's really a positive that you have in Houston is that you can, you know, my you know, you can drive a mile down the road and you can go speak to someone with a completely different cultural perspective than yourself. Representative Coleman as an elected official works, you know, with uh, Asian American members, African American members, uh, whites, Latinos, Latinas. And I think we all learn when we come together about our different communities and we're able to represent our districts and find out what's the best for all Texans. Inspired by our immigrant parents, diversity matters so much to us. It affects our daily lives. Our parents enjoy the ability to express and embrace their culture in American society. That aspect of America unifies us as a country, and it's exactly why our parents chose to come here. America has uh, accepted our family culture and also a religious belief and gave us a great opportunity to learn each other and also a better life for my family. So I personally think that uh, you know, United States is one of those few places where you get all those types of diversity, which opens doors for uh, not only people born in this country, but also people that come to this country. Overall, you know, I think that uh, um, you know, this makes a society um, better. We had the opportunity to better our lives like better schooling. We have the freedom to choose what we want to do as far as, you know, uh, better life, better home, better families, um, and also better for our children 
and for our great grandchildren. And because of that, uh, as you know, we have now lived in a better house, um, and I love this country. In the end, being American is about being proud of our differences.